Hi, this is James, and we're going to code review the genetic algorithm that evolves one picture into another. Here we go, and I'm just going to run it really quickly just to give you an idea of what it does. The picture on the right there is evolving into the picture on the left. The picture on the left is a picture of the uh, CN Tower, and the uh, Roger Center is next to it. So the picture on the uh, right is slowly uh, turning into the picture of the left. So you get the general idea. Uh, the longer I keep this uh, running, the closer it will be to the picture on the uh, left. All right, so we're going to uh, stop this. And I've programmed this in the uh, processing programming environment. And I'm going to assume a little bit of knowledge about um, genetic algorithms and uh, programming in processing. So um, I've created uh, two classes to manage this. The first one manages um, the generation e each uh, genetic algorithm or each generation and the other class I've called it splat. I just call my classes anything. Uh, this is each individual child in each uh, generation. So, um, uh, really, really quickly, we, when we instantiate the generation generator, um, we set the generation size, we create a new array of items or children, and we create the first generation, and that's uh, run in this uh, routine here. Um, then the next thing that we do is um, we're actually in the uh, draw routine here so we what we're doing here is we are for each uh, frame we are actually um, evolving 30 generations or breeding 30 generations and displaying the uh, healthiest of each one in the uh, in the uh, form and we are creating a new generation so when we create a new generation we take the best two children from each generation and we breed them together um, for, for how many we want in the next generation um, so we uh, yeah we breed, breed the two best uh, then we mutate the res result and then we calculate how close that is to the target. Um, that's it for that routine. Yeah, and it just keeps looping around. So the get healthiest is here. What it does, it, it gets the healthiest item in the uh, array. Uh, the one that is closest to the to the target. Uh, here is a breed, breed routine. Um, what it does is it it it, it just breeds the array uh, breeds the um, two best um, and produces uh, offspring and this just kind of randomizes the offspring. It levels out pretty quickly. This does, um, and you just kind of get kind of a flat background. Um, but when you add mutations. Um, so the mutation is on the splat here. Um, so uh, what this routine does is it will uh, choose between one and ten um, pixels and uh, just change it to a random color. And that's all it does, and it's it's this routine here that really really drives it the change. Um, it introduces new things into each new generation and they may uh, they may be kept and preserved because they're close to the target image or not. Thank you.